Can you travel during your probation? Probation comes with a host of rules and restrictions, often varying depending on the nature of the offense and the terms set by the court and your probation officer. If you're on probation, you may be wondering whether you're allowed to travel, especially if you need to do so for work, family, or leisure. This is a common concern, and the answer depends on your specific situation. Navigating the intricacies of probation and travel can be challenging, making it essential to consult a qualified Oakland County lawyer who understands Michigan law. Legal considerations for traveling during probation One of the most important legal considerations is that any travel plans you have must be approved by the court. Generally, you're not allowed to leave the state of Michigan without obtaining permission from the court or your probation officer. Sometimes, this permission can be arranged at the time of sentencing especially if travel is required for work. However, if a new travel need arises while you're on probation, you'll need to submit a request through your probation officer. Failing to get this approval could result in a violation of your probation, which could carry serious consequences. A real-world example highlights the importance of this rule. A client living in Florida, who is on probation in Michigan, decided to take a last-minute cruise to the Caribbean. Upon his return, Customs notified his Michigan probation officer that he had traveled out of the country without permission, leading to a violation of his probation. This situation underscores the need to take travel restrictions seriously. The interconnectedness of modern systems means that such violations are more easily detected, and the repercussions can be significant. Understanding Travel Restrictions Misdemeanor versus felony cases, the severity of your offense plays a significant role in determining your travel restrictions. For those on probation for a misdemeanor, there may be more flexibility, especially if you can demonstrate that travel is necessary for maintaining employment or fulfilling other essential obligations. In such cases, a probation officer might be more inclined to grant permission for out of state travel, provided the situation is deemed low risk. Conversely, individuals on probation for a felony may face stricter limitations. The court and probation officer might view such individuals as flight risks, making it harder to obtain travel approval. Even after probation ends, certain travel restrictions could remain in place, especially for those convicted of serious crimes. Therefore, it is crucial to maintain open communication with your probation officer and fully understand the conditions of your probation. How to manage travel during probation If you need to travel while on probation, the first step is to contact your probation officer to discuss your situation. It's important to be transparent about your plans, as honesty and clear communication can increase the likelihood of receiving permission. The probation officer will consider the nature of your travel, its necessity, and whether there is any risk of you failing to comply with the terms of your probation. For felons, traveling abroad can be particularly challenging. Although some felons can obtain a passport and leave the country after completing their sentence, those with convictions for crimes such as drug trafficking or financial fraud may be barred from obtaining a passport altogether. Additionally, even with a passport, some countries may deny entry based on your criminal record. Conclusion and next steps Understanding and adhering to your probation conditions is essential, especially when it comes to travel. If you're unsure about your rights and limitations, it's vital to consult with a criminal lawyer who can offer tailored advice. At Paul J. Tafelski, Michigan Defense Law, we can help you navigate these complex issues. Contact us today at 248-451-2200 or visit us at 2525 South Telegraph Road, Suite 100, Bloomfield Hills, Michigan, 48302, to schedule a consultation and ensure that your probation conditions are managed properly.